Today we're going to be listening to Yahweh Urushe, Mawa Anmiya Yanosika. My Polish is getting a lot better. My name is Wes, I am a professional pianist, and you can listen to my music on all music platforms. Ucałuj, jak zabawnych lat bywało. Mm, beautiful chord progression. Piano is fantastic, you know. I'm trying to pay attention to the lyrics and the video and everything, but I'm just listening to the piano and the piano playing is absolutely phenomenal. Okay, so I want to try a new segment with these reaction videos where I play a little bit of the music. Let me know if you guys like it and I can put it in future videos. Maybe in the future I'll do full covers, who knows, we'll see. The pianist in this song is really interesting because when I normally play a song, I keep it around the mid area. I like to combine my chords. Whereas this guy, he played his piano like more on the fringes. For example, in the beginning, he did like... So he played the melody up here in the top range and then he played like really loud bass notes. So his range is a lot wider. Whereas if I were to play the song, I like keeping all my chords together because it just sounds a lot more full. I'm a jazz pianist at heart. So I would have played it like. Something like that. Very, very cool though. Really, really nice what he did. My favorite part of the song, dude. That arpeggio that he does is amazing. So this girl is older, so I don't know if they did this on purpose, but maybe it's like different girls of increasingly older age to tell the story of what's going on. This 
zwojenki wrócisz do dziewczyny swej. Okay, so you notice how when he's playing the piano, he plays his chords up here. I personally don't like it because I think that interferes too much with the voice, so that's why I like to keep my chords down here. You notice how when I go up to like this higher octave, that melody is just very, very potent. So it cuts through everything and it kind of lowers the balance of my voice. So that's why I like to keep the chords lower, but that's just like personal style. Okay, so if I'm understanding the story correctly, the dad went away to war and then he died in battle and didn't come home. Yeah, this stuff is pretty heavy actually. It's, it's quite a deep song. This parallels to what's going on right now because I have a lot of Ukrainian friends. This exact same thing is happening in Ukraine. I think the music is doing a really good job of reflecting that. Like I, I was getting carried away because the piano was so good, but to be honest, uh, the story that this is telling, I imagine it's about war and the family waiting for the dad to come home from war. Pretty powerful stuff. And then the arrangement is good with the choir of all the kids singing it. I'm sure that's all purposeful. Come on, string section, tighten it up, tighten it up. <laughs> I know they're just kids, but I think the strings could be tighter. Okay, also I know that it's a serious song, but can we talk about how funny it is seeing the kids sing and play the instruments and they're just like dead padding the whole entire time, they're just like, Come on kids, look alive! <laughs> Let me know if you guys want to see more of this in future reaction videos. I highly recommend that you guys watch this video next. What song should I listen to? Let me know down below. Peace.